This file contains some media which isn't compatible with QuickTime Player. I don't get it, it's an MOV file. All right, so I don't know what happened. I think some translation problem happened coming from this phone. Yeah, this phone. Um, it's not playing on my Mac OS. I'm not sure, but I think there's a way to convert them. Let me show you how. Okay, to confirm the error, this is what I'm getting. You also notice the thumbnails don't show up in Finder. When I try to play in QuickTime, it plays as audio only. Back to the thumbnails, if you're familiar with Finder, if the video is okay, it'll show the cool little thumbnail just like these. Okay, enough with the refresh. How to convert the file format. Use this free application for Mac OS called Handbrake. Once you have Handbrake installed, go to the upper left, open source. Select the video you want to convert. If it shows a preview of your video, that is a good sign. On the upper left, it has presets for your output video settings. It has a lot of options. For this example, I'm going to convert to 4K. Once you have your output format selected, Handbrake needs to know where to place your converted files. On the bottom right, click Browse. Select the folder you want to dump the files in. To start the conversion, on the upper left, click the green arrow Start. While it's converting, you'll see on the bottom left the progress. You'll know when it's done when the percentage magically disappears. Once it's done converting, open Finder and go to the output folder you chose. If it has a thumbnail, it'll probably work. Verify by opening the video. All right, what if you have multiple files to convert? There's an easy way to do a batch. On the upper left, go to open source. Select the multiple files you want to convert. Back to the upper left, hit the drop down arrow on Q. Verify all your files are selected, then hit add. Double check your output folder. Hit start Q to process. To check the overall status of the job, on the upper right go to Q and it'll give you more detail. Once they are all done, test your newly converted videos. All right, folks, have a ton of fun doing computer stuff. If you have any questions or comments, let me know. Goodbye.